it is creepy big brother. Like, <laughs> it's creepy big brother. It, I mean, it, it's like a level, level, of, like it, I don't want to say it freaks me out, but it, it disturbs me. Twitter's overarching surveillance begs the question, how private are your privates. I get to look at all the reported tweets, oh. which means I've seen a lot of dick pics. It's ridiculous. <laughs> so how do you keep those from popping up? Um, like, are there like little robots? There are bots. Um, there's something called machine learning, which basically, when someone reports uh, that picture, um, it gets put into a database, and okay. then as more, more of those pictures come into place, uh, the machine, uh, our services learn, uh, that, that's not appropriate. Yeah, and, okay. and also more, more along the lines that they can actually start guessing, like, is this is this uh, equipment or is this maybe like an elbow or something? Yeah, so. or is this just a man named Dick? Yeah, exactly. When I met with Clay Haynes last week, he was quite forthcoming about his access to intimate photos. Did you say something about that when you were saying you um, looked at Twitter? Yeah, like nothing's yeah. really deleted. No, yeah. Uh, oh, wow. Yes, and, Yes, I did. And no, it's not. <laughs> like everything, like everything. like even everything. like DMs. Oh yeah, we can actually read your DMs. <laughs> I've seen way more penises than I've ever wanted to see in my life. On what? DM messages? DMs, tweets, yes. Penises. Lots of dicks. It sounds like there's a lot of porn involved in what you do. Oh, yeah. and <laughs> Unfortunately, there is a lot of porn. I mean, when you see all these, like, dicks, like, that's crazy. That's, yeah. Like, and, and for, you know, actually, I've never I know been able to, yeah, yeah. Uh, this sounds horrible, but yeah. I'm actually glad and fortunate it's just dicks, or yeah. it's just blowjob pictures, yeah. or it's oh, just wow. that, that type of stuff. No, these are, like, private messages. Both private and public messages. It's like People DMs, are, too. Yeah. yeah. That's kind of scary that that stuff is stored, you know what I mean? Yep. Yeah. Like, you know, and... That could be, that could be shared. I mean, do you, you have access to DMs at Twitter? Oh, I, I do, yeah. Okay. So when you people have access to this stuff, they can, they can leak it. It happens. Oh, yeah. Know? And it's a genie out of the bottle kind of thing after that point. Yeah. You know, sure, I could fire them. Heck, I could probably even sue them in some cases. Oh, yeah. But the genie's already out of the bottle. Like, how do you actually recoup costs that you... You can't calculate the cost or the damage of that. Of sharing a, of sharing a penis picture. Yeah. yeah. There's teams dedicated to it. I mean, we're talking we're talking about three or four, at least three or three or four hundred people. Yes, they're paid to look at dick pics. You know, there's girls that will spread eagle pictures on there. Whoa. Like a boyfriend and a girlfriend, right? No. What is that? Porn stars. Why are they DMing a People. They're trying to get people to, you know, go buy their videos and shit. To, to, to private messages. Private message, public message. Yeah. With access to your most intimate photos and information, Twitter is big brother. What's more alarming, they're not the biggest brother. Do they know anything from like ad services though? Like you know how like ad companies know a bunch about you? We know some stuff. We are in FPS, Facebook, or Google, but we know some stuff. So there you have it. Twitter is aggressively harvesting your personal information, tracking your every movement, your thoughts, and your private correspondence with your significant other. According to Clay Haynes, Twitter's senior network security engineer, if that privilege is abused, then you, quote, can't calculate the cost of that damage. American Pravda by James O'Keefe. Adventure, betrayal, truth. Pre-order today at AmericanPravdaBook.com.